Yo, what's up guys, Dish Girls 88 here, welcome back to another Clash Royale video, and in this video, we're going to be using this deck that I just made, and actually not, we're not going to use it, we're just going to watch some replays, and I wanted to show you, this deck is insane, look at all the draws, I'm going to win, but I've had one, two, three, three draws in a row, and I started using this deck, right here 12 hours ago i used this deck and i just wanted to show you like all the victories i got with this deck because so far it's been doing really good and i kind of and i wanted to show you like the draws and the replays and the victories and stuff so yeah we're just gonna watch the victory oh wait i don't want to no, never never mind hold on <laughs> sorry okay i don't need i need to no okay so yeah i did not do it Four times so okay we're against burke 543 from a, a, a some a clan i do not know the name of so so far we're both at eight and let me go to ten obviously and so he's i'm trying to wait for him to play something but he doesn't play anything so i just put a hog rider there and then he puts a wizard back to counter my hog but i still get a few decent hits off but then he does he does counter it with the barbs and so I just put Bomber to take care of that. And then I put Arrows to take care of the Skeleton Army. And then the Wizard almost gets a few shots off. But I have the Valkyrie, fortunately, to take care of that. And so far I've gotten at least 200 hits. Or 200 damage on that tower. And the Valkyrie's going to do a lot of damage on this one. And so he has a Lava Hound. So I put an Infernal t Dragon, oh my god, and Musketeer. And this is a really good combo to take down a Lava Hound. I don't know. It's just, it just, it melts it really fast. And then he's put a Zap to take care of that. So yeah, if he doesn't have Minion Horde, this is a really good push. Or he doesn't have Fireball, it's a really good push. Because then you have the Inferno Dragon. It's locked onto the tower. And then the tower starts shooting it. And then the Musketeer gets him a lot of shots off. It snipes the tower. And so yeah, he puts a Prince, which is pretty annoying. But luckily, I, I don't really have, like, like a really good counter to the Prince other than Inferno Dragon and, like, the Prince itself. So he has a level 6 hog, and so I put Inferno Dragon, and those little skeletons over there try to be rebels and and just go for the tower, other tower. But I just arrow the other skeleton army, so, yeah. Okay. It's, a, it's actually a pretty slow battle so far. Like, nothing major is happening, but... I am winning by 300 points, which is pretty good. And this guy's saving up for a leather lava hound push. A lover lava, another lava hound push. And so I need to get a, I need to get a musketeer down. But oh, he has a witch, and so I just do that. And then I put I I put all those troops down, but he fireballs it. So all that's left is an inferno dragon, which is sucky. But I just arrowed that, and then I zap the lava pups. But my hog rider is doing a lot of work, so that's really good. And then I just put a musket. I put a prince. What? What do I do? Oh, I put a prince down for the hog, and then I put a Valkyrie for the musketeers, and then I have a really good push. It's really nice. And then I just put Valkyrie in front, prince in back, and then an inferno dragon. So I'm gonna get a lot of hits off. Except, if he didn't have that skeleton army, I would have been fine. But, I do get, like, 20 damage off, it looks like. But, still, it's okay. So far, we are neck and neck. We are literally really close in damage. Like, we are... Uh, except I win. So, yeah, I won. But, we were really close. As you can see, his towers... My towers are like 377. So... And, and also, we're going to be looking at my draw. We're going to look at, I guess, this draw. So, yeah, we're going to look at this draw. And then we're just going to have a one life battle to show you guys if it's good or not. So, we're against Joker03, the Metal Italy le legend. So, I put down. Oh my god, my dad. Hold, like, look, wait, do, do, 
do, okay, whatever. So yeah, you put on a Valkyrie and a Hog Rider that does a lot of damage, I guess. But then he has Leap Barbarians and another Valkyrie to counter that. And he tries to counter that with like, like Spear Goblins for some reason. But then the Elite Barbarian's got like a lot of hits off. And so I have to put, I don't know what I need to put. And he's just killing my tower. It's all the way down to like 382, which is really, really bad. And it's in the angry face I put well played because I don't know what I'm going to do. And so I put a Valkyrie and then I put a Inferno Dragon in the back. But he has Minion Horde, so that kind of sucks. So, oh my god, yeah, whatever. Oh, hold on. I need. To I'm gonna close the door just for a minute. So I'm just gonna close the door and then turn on the light. So, oh god, that's bright. Yeah, I probably should have done that a long time ago, but I don't care. Okay, so now I just I don't even know what I did. Hold on. So yeah, I've been Inferno Dragon, and they have a bomber going at the tower, and so that is. Pretty good. I'm go I'm down. It's down to 1475 hit points. It's not the best, but it's I don't know what else I I would do. I send in a prince and a hog rider combo, and that doesn't. And my hog does a lot of damage, but unfortunately he does have elite barbarians. He's gonna counter my prince and my hog, and then he has one elite barbarian with like a sliver of health left, and so that I almost take out the Valkyrie. But I just need, like, I don't know, like one more hit. And the hog almost gets a hit off, leaving my tower at 163 hit points. And I'm really nervous right now. I'm not sure what he's going to do. If he has arrows, if he has a rocket, a fireball would have been sucky as heck. So I send in a hog rider. Hopefully I get it. But he sends goblins and a Valkyrie. And I zapped that, but unfortunately, level 7 zap does not work against level 8 goblins. Like, that's pretty obvious, but... Okay, he sends arrows to counter that, and it's down to 74. And I am really close. The push, this push is massive right now. I have a really, really aggressive push. I just, I just got the tower down. I'm like freaking out. I'm like, wait, what? Did I almost win? But, yeah, he has arrows and a hog coming. So no, I did not win, and he just, and now we're in the overtime, we're about to draw, well we did draw, well no, we're almost about to draw, yeah I guess, you're almost, almost about to draw, he puts a lot of goblins down to counter it, and I just have to put like a prince, hog rider, in front of a dragon, but then he counters it with a minion horde, oh my god, and I don't know, I don't know, so far I'm, I'm winning, basically crap. King Tower wise, but I'm still, it's still, we're still tied. So, he's in the Valkyrie and Goblin, and level 8 Goblins. I don't know. Push, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's a really weird push, but I guess it works, against, especially against me. And so, he spends Elite Barbarians. I, spent, I, I put down um, Valkyrie and Bomber, and it's going okay. We're, about, we're just about to tie, and then after this, I guess we're going to do a live battle. And also, I forgot to tell you guys, th this year, or t tonight, is New Year's Eve. Happy New Year's Eve, everyone. And at like 11.45, if my parents let me, I'm going to make a video then. And we're going to have an awesome New Year's Eve party together. I guess, just rocking out and stuff. I might even like react to my, my old video. Maybe, probably not. So yeah, we're doing a live battle right now. And we're against Elias from, I think it's like, looks s Swedish. But he has a P.E.K.K.A. What? Oh, oh, but he's leaving my prince alone except for a hog. But that's okay. Just the, it's going to get no hits off. The prince is going to get a lot of hits off. And I want to put down Musketeer and Inferno Dragon. And that's going to basically shred. I mean, I mean shred. Uh, like the, oh, oh, oh my, that did not go as planned, because the guy zapped my Inferno d d Dragon, Ugh. that's what I would do though, I guess, because I can't blame him, but still, so mean, oh, okay, okay, a, a, okay, 
Okay. What? Valkyrie, you're not gonna help out? Okay, so, but that tower's down. I, I, don't, I don't know why I left it alone for that long. But, yeah, the tower's down. The other tower's down to 888, which is... Meh. I guess. So, we have a, a bomber going at the left tower. And now we're gonna send in a hog rider. Hopefully this goes well. Okay. Go. Go. Damn. Darn. Okay, so we know we have an Inferno Dragon, and we have a Zap ready, in case he has whatever he has. Oh, shoot, that was dumb. Oh, shoot. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Oh. Yo, that was really close. I really wish I had a Fireball. A Fireball would have been really nice in this deck. But I guess I can't. I guess what, I don't know when I'm gonna replace it though. So, no. Okay. I need to win. Okay. So, this is a pretty good push. Valkyrie Hog. Oh, Giant Skelly. Come on. Come on, Hog. Yeah, now we have. We're just in the right place so we can zap this. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oops. I'm gonna bomb that. Oop, I need to bomber that. Alright, okay. Yeah. So far, if we tie one more time, because, like, I was trying to make a video before, and then, like, my mic my didn't pick up, and so I started making, like, a bunch of videos like this, or a bunch of, like, matches, and then I kept tying, like, all of them. So. Oh, I put a Pekka there. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. Oh, my God, crud. Oh, uh, nope, we're gonna win. I'm gonna say, tell him GG. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. I'm gonna have to say, erg, we'll play, and good game. So, yeah, guys. Okay. So, yeah, this is gonna wrap up from this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, hit the like button. If you want to see more of these, comment down below. And, yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!